Hey, hey, hey. Welcome to Gigi and Stitches. Hey. <laughs> it is a beautiful sunny day here. Well, it is. Um, today is April the 12th. And I have a lot to share with you today. So if you need a minute to go get your caffeine fix and bring it, I have mine. She's lagging. I think she's done had six cups this morning. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> That's why our hair looks all confused because we didn't drink. We've been drinking too much caffeine this morning. So we have been having a little difficulties trying to get this video. The first five went smooth. Everything that could have went wrong yesterday did. From the ice cream truck, the dogs having a fiesta, um, somebody came over during what else happened yesterday uh, a video just would not work so we have a new i don't know what you want to call it some kind of app for the webcam on the computer tr to try to make it better so if you see us playing with stuff we haven't learned which side we're supposed to be on And also yesterday, we, or I, uh, Natalie informed me that I was going way too fast. And I would be done. And 10 minutes later, she would be flopping her arms over there like a chicken. Did you say the chicken? I like the chicken. <laughs> <laughs> so I went on a four day getaway where I went to Pensacola Beach for a couple of days and I went to Biloxi for a couple of days I love the beach I just needed to get away and and um, get some fresh air so I heard that Hobby Lobby was having a sale on their charts. And I don't mind so much charts, uh, uh, not charts, kits. And um, so when I was going to get something to eat, when I first got down there, I discovered the Hobby Lobby. Needless to say, I went to Hobby Lobby before I got a hamburger. I went there not only once, but twice. And then I went to Biloxi. And I did. And I say visited. I think visited is a light term rated would be more the word um, we tried to count the charts before we started the video and we just decided to say 75 plus just to make ourselves look like we don't need to be in rehab And I say rehab, or I say we as in the two of us, but she wasn't in my pocket when I was purchasing all of it. And she didn't cross stitch, but I say we, so I don't look like I have a problem, but I do. Because if it's a sale, you can't beat it. So I want to show some of the things that I've got. I got from Hobby Lobby. I can't, I'm not going to show all of them because, well, y'all have to eat sometime. 
But the first thing I got, what, it's so cute. Is that right? Isn't that the cutest thing? They are so cute. Kind of look like, I think they're gnomes. Amanda had said yesterday that they look like Gnomeo. And then, look at that. She's stitching his bridges. Isn't that the cutest thing, man and woman? That looks like me and my husband right there. I'm always sewing something. So after I purchased all of these charts, he told me that we needed to hold up for the rest of the month and not spend any more money on, on kits and stuff. Then he went to Hobby Lobby and purchased me this one. Love this one. Look at the green polka dotted there. Sweet little kitty cat. And then the puppy dogs. I think these were $40 a piece on sale for 10 And I think the best deal that I bought on a chart was $80 for $7.25. $7.25. That's not bad. I also, I'm, I'm going to show you some more that I purchased, but that's going to be towards the end of the video because it's the Stitch Mania, I think. I've got 11 more to go, but I'm going to sh um, show you my whips because it's not very many. This is the Design Works. Wedding sampler. And I finished B, I, and I finished up <laughs> the K. I had already had the, what's that, L complete. And this little joker is going to have to go up for a couple of months because, look at this. Y'all see it? All that gray coming in. It, it's not hard. It's just so time consuming. And there's only so much that I can take in a day and it's past its limit. So, that is all that I did while I was in Pensacola and Biloxi. And night before last, I sat down and I, sti I started stitching the, can you, am I right? Uh, this is um, mm, I want to say Country Cottage Needleworks The Gingerbread House Number 3. I I have so many charts that are from Little House and Country Cottage that I get them mixed up at times, and I'm sorry. Um, I thought I had it written down, but I don't. Then, let's see. And that's that was all of the whips. It's sad, but true. So sad, but true. Um, before I go any further, I want to thank Michelle, Miss Bendy Stitchy, for the shout out. I really do appreciate that very much. Uh, I don't know what that is. Something popped up on the screen. Another technical difficulty. <clears throat> but 
again, thank you, Michelle, for the shout out. I really do appreciate it. And I have a bone that I need to pick up with you about. Did I say that correctly? Mm -hmm. Yesterday in the video, everything I said did not make sense. Now I know at this point that you ain't got to do that. At this point, I'm going to cut this out because that didn't make any sense to me. It should be, I have a bone I want to pick with you. What did you say? I don't know, but it, that's not what it was. Uh, I'm pretty sure you did. <laughs> did I? Well, I'm going to cut that part out, and we're going to go with, and I, uh, let me get rid of this, because that's going to drive me nuts. How do you get rid of that? There. But what is, okay, whatever. Okay. I would like to thank Bendy Stitchy. Michelle Garrett for the shout out. I have a bone that I need to pick with you. And that'll be in just a little bit. I purchased some Franny Ritter designs. The first one is Snow Buddies. Heroes. The colors in that egg are so gorgeous. Then, I think everybody has Farmhouse Christmas from Little House. I did purchase from my dealer all of the called for colors. I just haven't decided what fabric that I'm going to use. And I'm fixing to take a detour down this road we're on. She's used to it. You see her eyes? Oh dear, mama not again. But I had to order some belts for my steam cleaner because someone likes to steam clean their hair on the floor. And it stretched the belt. So I went and went to Amazon and I purchased some because they didn't have any in, the, in our town. I don't think you should be able to sell a vacuum or steam cleaner if you're not going to carry the parts in your store. But I accidentally purchased Monk, M-O-N-K, cloth. I have no idea what this is. I put it in my um, cart. I was going to ask someone never heard of it if you've ever used monk's cloth could you please let me know how it worked out is it a soft fabric hard fabric difficult to work with now it was a good buy because it was a yard for 10 bucks but i'm thinking is it something I need to throw over my legs and use as a throw? I'm not sure. Now I'm coming back up the road. And I bought Homespun Elegance. Spring Eggs 5. Am I covering you? My baby girl loves chicks, so that's going to become hers, I'm sure. And then I purchased my first prairie schooler, and it's spring and fall. I had no idea that it was half a year, 
So you know I've got to go back and get the other half. I mean, if you have a summer, I mean, a spring and fall, you have to have your summer and winter. I mean, that's just not right if you don't. I have two more tiny modern, modernist. The March. Little sheep. And April is just too cute. Look at that cat. Looking like a bunny. Love the eggs in the air. I guess they're rotten because they're flying. Cutest thing. And then I have a Barbara Anna Designs. It has, it's called Oh Christmas Tree. It has two cardinals in the tree and some snow people sorry about that did that do it yeah i need a little there we go it's hard to see <laughs> let's see if i can get jeanette douglas designs correct in every video I did, I said letters from home. And it is letters from mom. And this has nine more that goes around it. So I'm really looking forward to getting the rest of those. I'll probably be doing it when my, uh, my kids will be wondering why right now. I'll be sitting here stitching, stitching them letters and fabric. Apparently, spring is in the air. I have a spring has sprung, Rebecca the reindeer. Look at her eyes. She looks like she is drunk from pollen. The buds in her antlers. She is so cute. And this is by Marnick Designs. Now, Michelle, the next two charts that I purchased are your fault. It's because you had to show on your last video samplers. Y'all know if you don't know, I'm telling you, I have a problem. She was just telling me that I needed to go to, what did you say? Cross Stitch Anonymous. <laughs> now, to me, Cross Stitch Anonymous means I can cross stitch as long as I don't tell people who I am. So I can be Sam, and I'm anonymous, right? These two charts, samplers that I bought, are by Little House. The Elizabeth Hancock sampler. Oops. Oops. I love that one. If you have this one, you should do a sale with me. And then the Orch Orchard Valley Quilting Bee. It's too cute. I'm sorry. We will learn. Just hold your head this way. You'll have it. That is all for right now that is not all the purchases that i purchased i have a problem i really do but uh, it'll be all right it will be okay now <clears throat> for the 
Stitch Mania, I want to do 31 starts in the 31 days. Don't know which one I'm going to do first, but I will do something. For some reason, if I, I have gotten into a fascination with teapots. That's going to be one that I do in Mania. How cute is this little hedgehog? Sorry you can't see it from the stickers, but I haven't had a chance to open them yet. And this is my third small one. A little turkey. I think these three right here would be cute if I could get a magnet and stick them on the refrigerator. I think that would be really cute because they're so small. And then I have I bought this one for my husband. It says, honey, you are so delicious. So delicious. Love soda. And then this is one I found in uh, Biloxi and fell in love. How cute is that little bunny? And she has, it has the ribbon in there for her hair. She is just too cute. And then I am going to do the boating by Heinzig. That one will be for my husband too. It has the, I don't know, my favorite thing in there is the lighthouse and the fish. I think that is just cool. Another one, A Good Marriage. By Lizzie Kate. And Sharon, my pen pal, gave me this fabric. And I think that the two of these together would look good. I'm sorry. We'll have it down in a couple of videos. I'm not drinking anything but Coke. Another one. Isn't that funny? Coke. You're giving yourself a shot. There's certain things that she does that catches my attention. And Coke is one. And the little chicken. Little beak. <laughs> it just tickles me. Um... Another Lizzie Kate, she believes she could. Bent Creek. Teacher Row. This one will go to the teacher in the house. Oop, wrong way, sorry. Another Best Teacher by Glory B. Ooh. And I have another Prairie Schooler. It's Santa 1991. D, Donna from D Squared and I were supposed to start this April the 1st. I don't know whether she did or not. I have not. I'm going to start this in May. This one is from the Cricut with Bad Eyes, Spring, on um, this one, can't, there we go. I'm going to play with the colors. I don't like the, the fabric that it's on, and I like my, I like bright, vibrant colors. 
So I will probably change that up. I like the colors of this, just not the fabric in the Lizzie Kate Spring Smiles. And then I have a year in chalk. I have, this is by Hands On Design. I have January, where's it? February. March, April, May, and June. I'm going to start all of these for, but I do want an opinion. While I was in um, Biloxi and Pensacola, I did stitch, that's part of January. Do y'all like that? Or should I try to do something with the black to make it, the fabric to make it lighter? And this is the start of February. Black, I don't know if it's because I'm older I don't know if it's because I have something wrong with my eye, but oh my goodness, I don't ever remember having a time cross that was so hard to cross stitch on something. I mean, I had all the lights on. I bought me one of those little head lights, trying to see, and had a flashlight up underneath and the headlight on top, and I get, I, you know, put it. From the outside, I guess it looked like I was having a laser show in there. I don't know. Another one that I want to start next month is a, a Proms, uh, Proverbs 31, A Virtuous Woman. Love this one. And it's a sampler. I just fell it all into that. And then, Sue Hillis, America the Beautiful. I'm really excited about doing this one. I was thinking, and I think I said last week that I was going to put a um, X on it. But if I can find little charms, like, oh my goodness, Georgia is a peach. If I could find a little peach to go in there, as like I have been there, Mississippi is a magnolia. Um, I, my brain is gone blank. But if I could find little charms to go in there instead of putting an X on it, I think that would look super cute. If y'all know of any charms that are like small, 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 let me know. And let me know where to get them so I can purchase them. And then... My next one is by My Big Toe, and it is the Names of Jesus. And let's, sorry, Matt. It says to do it in pecan pie and cranberry. Well, that'll make you hungry, and I really don't like the dark colors. Pink, I like pinks and blues and greens. So if anybody has any suggestions on what would make this look really good, I want it to, it'll, it'll go on the wall with my Jesus that I did. So if y'all can think of any beautiful colors that would enhance that, I would greatly appreciate your advice. And then I was watching Helen, the East Coast Stitcher. And she has stitched or was stitching this. Fell in love with it. I, I have all four of them. They come out of the magazine. I believe they're hands-on design. But I got it out of the Just Cross Stitch magazine. I have got all four of them. But I want to do spring for spring. Um. 
You got it from what magazine? Cross Stitch magazine. That coffee running out. <laughs> she don't need to add so much water next time. <laughs> oh my goodness, that is so funny. Okay. Um, Lisa Stitch Stable, Stitch and Stable, had a giveaway on her page. And I won the giveaway. It has four buttons, four heart buttons. And it also has this teapot. That would make a great needle minder. It is a little big. But I have projects that are a little big. But I just think that is so pretty. It's from Nikki Trevo Designs. I love it. And she also sent me some folders so that I could put some of my stuff in. And I will do that because... I told my husband he needs to build me a she shed with a walkway so I will not get wet. I want my recliner in there, my chair. Did I say a chair? Mm -hmm. My recliner, my bed, and a refrigerator in there, and an air conditioner. You can't live in Mississippi without an air conditioner. Well, you can, but you're going to be a miserable soul. Okay. So, I've been told you about all my addictions. I'm not ashamed. I'll be ginger sometimes. Gigi sometimes. And Sam. Is that enough people? Or do I need a few more? You're good. Three people's enough? I have enough stash for three people? You have more than that. Probably got enough for 50. True story. I had mentioned on the last video that when we got to 300 subscribers that I was going to do a giveaway. The only time I play by the rules is with my children. So, I decided that I wanted to do a giveaway now. Just because it's spring. Just because I can. And, actually, I'm going to give two away. Uh, the first one is... By the Bay Needle Art, Stitch an Inch, Spring, uh, keep it. yeah, there we go, Stitch an Inch, I'm sorry if you can't see it, I will, I will take a picture and put this on Instagram, because it is hard to see. And I don't know that if I remove it, I don't like opening things that are not. Let's see if that's any better. Yeah. Is that better? Uh, there we go. There's nothing in my Coke. <laughs> I promise. And then the next one. I'm not going to try to say, because I do not want to butcher their name, but it is a sampler. Is it right? If you will leave in the comments 
which one you prefer, one or two, uh, tell me why, what you like about spring, 